Hey guys, it's Cass, and today I'm going to be doing a honest review on this. Oh, she's slippery. <laughs> on this product right here. So it's the Dr. Dennis Gross. I'm gonna say gross. I don't know if that's how you say it. It is spelt gross, but I'm guessing it's gross. Spectralite Face Wear Pro. Now, this one here is the limited edition. The normal one, I believe, is like a white and rose gold, but I do love pink. Don't know, <laughs> don't know if you could tell, but I love pink and special edition, pretty cool. So I decided to get this one. There is no difference, aside from the color. So, why not? Now, now I'm looking pretty, pretty rough. Um, my skin is not having a fun time at the moment. I don't know what she's doing, but it's itchy. It's aggravated, it's painful, it's not fun. I have a really bad breakout all on this side of my face and I can literally feel something here. My whole, like, I haven't had a breakout this bad in ages. I have been eating a lot of chocolate and other things. A lot of bad food but usually it wouldn't be this bad so I was doing some research I've started using some new skincare products um, which actually are really good mind you but this caught my eye now at almost $700 AUD so wherever you're watching this is I'm talking about Australian pricing Australian currency I know it's like 435 or something US I'm not sure but just make sure you guys know that it's that price AUD just in case anyone from anywhere in the world is watching this I haven't opened it yet I'm very excited to use it try it out this is not sponsored I don't usually make YouTube videos but I don't know I thought this would be a really cool journey that we could follow together it is a very very expensive product so I thought might as well make the most of it see if there's progress tell you guys everything on the way and if you should invest in one as well because I assume before buying a product so expensive you would research it and hopefully find my video let's get to the <laughs> okay I'm sorry this shouldn't be this hard I'm just I'm not <sighs> already open on it. I assume my mum opened it. Um, well not opened it, opened it. Just, oh god. It's not easy. It's kind of like, it's tight. Anyway, I am such a child. Okay. <laughs> I've probably broken it. Alright, it's She is shiny. All right, so I've got my little extru instruction instruction manual. Am I okay? And ta-da! Alrighty, so there is a strap that I'm guessing you feed through. There's like another little insert here. I'm guessing you feed that through and then feed it through there and make it as tight as you need. Um, it is really cool that you can use this mask without having to close your eyes because it does have like eye holes and oh, this is really cool. I just want to like, I'm not going to place it on my face. Okay. Um, no, I'm not. Not now, because I have makeup and I, I just don't want to get... <laughs> I don't want to get stuff on it. But you can see all the LEDs in there. Uh, I don't know if I can turn it on. I don't know. No, I doubt it will have any charge yet. So I'll obviously go through all of that when I see you guys in a month. I might do weekly updates. I'm not sure yet. Obviously, we'll see as this video progresses. But first impressions... It's like a very nice, well-built mask. I am going to be doing 
the nine minute sessions. So you can do red for three minutes, blue for three minutes, and both of them for three minutes. So nine minutes in total. You can obviously, if you don't have like blemishes or anything, you can just use it on the red, which is for like wrinkles and stuff, and just do it for three minutes if you don't have the time. But I will be doing the cycle of nine minutes and seeing, hopefully seeing those results. This obviously my main goal is for blemishes. Don't really have any wrinkles, I am only 20, although I do move my forehead a lot, so maybe some of my expression lines will go away. Who knows? I just have a very expressive face, which is a good thing, you know? Actually, it can be, and it, people always know what I'm thinking, most of the time. So yeah, I'm really glad I got the limited edition. I think it's super cool. Um, they give you a little charging cable and everything in here. But yeah, I'll be going through my journey. I, yeah, I don't know if it's showing up on camera, but yeah, I'm, it's, it's exploding. Help. Uh, <laughs> anyway, I will see you guys in a week or a month. I'm not sure yet. Maybe weekly updates would be good, but I feel like it does take a little while to see the results. So I'll keep in touch and I will see you guys soon. Hello and welcome back. It has been a lot longer than I anticipated. I was meant to film it like the second part to this a month after I got the product. <laughs> and I filmed that on I think the 28th of October. It's now the 27th of March. So what's that? That's November, December, January, February. Pretty much four months um, since I filmed the first part of the video where I said I would test it out, etc, etc. But to be honest, it's probably better that I have done it for like a longer period of time just because this product actually can take a couple of months to see results from so a month almost was kind of like too short anyway so it's ended up good that I've <laughs> waited a lot's changed I have copper hair and I'm actually changing it again on Friday so <laughs> I'm all over the place what else has happened? I don't work in the car industry anymore. I don't even know. So much has changed. But my skin is the main focus of this video. Now, I have been getting a lot tanner, so I probably look a bit healthier than I looked in the previous clip. I was looking at it before and I was like, oh my god, I'm so pale. I didn't get out in the sun at all because of my old job. Now, I have tried a few different methods of using this. I used to just use it at night and I would do the three cycles. So I would do the red light, the blue light, and the combined. They all go for three minute cycles, but then I ultimately decided to kind of switch it up and I did the combined cycle in the morning, so three minutes after I cleansed, and then at night I would do the red light and the blue light because I always had a little bit more time um, at night. Now, results on my skin. I have very sensitive skin to like drinking alcohol, eating sugary foods, stress, hormones, like pretty much anything makes it flare up. And I have noticed since using this I probably haven't experienced as severe or regular breakouts. Um, I used to pretty much have pimples on my chin like all the time and I don't really have any at the moment. I did actually have a random breakout just this week like here but I have been drinking quite a bit of alcohol so it makes sense. But yes for the most part the break breakouts sorry have toned down quite a lot as to what they used to be like and I'd also say that I don't know if it's just in my head but 
say in the morning I cleanse my skin and I've got like a bit of a pimple going on or a few. If I use the mask after I cleanse, I just feel like it kind of makes everything look a bit brighter and refreshed and it almost kind of like heals the pimple. So if you've got one that's not, um, uh, what should I call it? If you've got one that's like a bit tender and it's not flat, it almost seems to dry it out a bit. I don't really know, but I don't know if that's just me I and mean, I'm just thinking that, but to be honest, I think it really does work and that's obviously the blue light component. Uh, it does target bacteria from deep inside the skin cells and yeah, so if you suffer from breakouts, just know that you should probably look at what you're eating and your lifestyle before considering purchasing a big investment such as this but if you've you know tried absolutely everything you're not eating lots of refined sugar you're not eating lots of like bad fats you know like mcdonald's kfc etc you're eating relatively healthy your fitness levels are adequate i'm not talking like you have to do crazy gym stuff i just mean walking running swimming whatever you may do Alcohol can be a contributing factor, so if you are experiencing breakouts and you're not sure why and you have been drinking quite a bit, your liver obviously may struggle and that kind of shows up on the skin. What else? Think of things like gluten intolerances, etc. Definitely hormones is a big one, especially for girls. Uh, if you're noticing that it's only kind of happening in your cycles, then it's probably hormonal, but this definitely does aid help and prevent breakouts, I'd say, with regular use. Now, as for the red light, <laughs> I have a very expressionful, that's not even a word, but face. So I make a lot of expressions and I guess, you know, like I kind of get forehead lines, obviously, when I'm making those expressions. And I noticed that I used to have probably like two deeper forehead lines, like they weren't deep, but in my head, obviously. No one else would probably notice but after using this it's pretty much like flat i almost never notice the lines and if i do they're super super faint i think that the red light has honestly diminished fine lines even though i'm super young i'm like 20. but yeah i think the red light part could be onto something if you want to do some preventative stuff i'm not one that kind of is into botox and lip fillers and stuff if you are totally fine but for me personally I hate needles to put it lightly uh, so yeah the thought of needles freaks me out so this is like my natural solution to Botox but anyway yeah I think that if if you've tried everything else and you you know think about investing in light therapy at uh, clinics where they do obviously the light therapy maybe once a week once every two weeks that can add up so if you are pressed for time you want something at home that will do the trick I definitely recommend this and I've also been using a lot of the Dr. Dennis face products whilst using this so I have the cleanser I have the moisturizer and I have been using sometimes the face peels the gentle ones I think the face, sorry, the face peels are really good. Um, obviously, if you have sensitive skin, I would recommend getting gentle. And then they have, I think, a normal one and then an extreme one. I assume the extreme one is for people who are a little older and have a bit more aged skin. But yeah, look, honest opinion, you probably don't need it, but if you have the extra money and you want some of the added benefits of this i think in the long run it is a really good investment but yeah as for acne and stuff i still get breakouts if i'm not watching what i eat etc but this definitely does help calm them down a bit or it lessens the duration but yeah 
I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know in the comments below what you'd like to see more of, if you found this video helpful, if you have one of those face masks yourself, I'd love to know. Don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll see you in the next video. Bye!